Are you wondering where most boutiques are shopping for wholesale clothing? Well, keep watching to find out. Hi, I'm Raquel and since 2006, I have started multiple online boutiques as well as two brick and mortar locations. And now I teach other women how to start and scale thriving boutique businesses of their own. If you're looking to get started on your online boutique, make sure to watch my free workshop, Five First Steps to Start Your Online Boutique, which I'll link for you below in the description. So whether you're just getting started in the boutique business or you're looking for ways to increase your sales, make sure to also subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss out on any important boutique business tips. All right, so these are my top three places to buy women's wholesale clothing. These are all places that I have shopped at before or someone that I know has shopped there and absolutely loves this vendor. Before you go ahead and try to apply for an account with these vendors, you will need your LLC and seller's permit info. So if you haven't applied for those yet, make sure to do that. I'll go ahead and also link below my videos about LLCs and seller's permits to help you out. Okay. Up first is fashiongo.net. And this is probably one of the number one online virtual showrooms. Most of the showrooms featured on Fashion Go are physically located in downtown Los Angeles at the San Pedro Mart. It's a great place to start when you're just getting started. If you live near Los Angeles or you can travel there, I highly recommend making your first buying experience in person. It's super important to know what you're buying and the quality of what you're buying when you're first getting started. It used to be that all of the virtual showrooms on Fashion Go were located in Los Angeles at the San Pedro Mart, like I said, but now I've noticed that some are actually shipping from China, which may be more expensive for you and take longer to receive. So I just want you to be mindful of that when you are shopping on Fashion Go. Make sure to pay attention where the vendor is located. I'll add in a little scrolling of their website so that you can see all of the different products that they carry on Fashion Go. So if you are selling women's clothing, you definitely can probably find what you're looking for on Fashion Go. The second top showroom that everybody shops at is lashowroom.com. And LA Showroom is very similar to Fashion Go and a lot of the same vendors are on both websites. That being said, I do still buy from both websites as sometimes some of the vendors aren't on Fashion Go and LA Showroom. So again, LA Showroom is going to have a lot of vendors that are physically located in Los Angeles at the San Pedro Mart. But it's definitely worth signing up for both because some of the vendors aren't on both websites. The third one is FAIR. So FAIR is a fairly new online showroom, but it's getting rave reviews. Their products and vendors are carefully curated and selected, so they are all very trendy and they have great pictures. The one downside to FAIR is that some vendors can be more expensive on FAIR than what they are charging for wholesale on other sites like LA Showroom or Fashion Go. So this is also another reason that I say try to hit up the San Pedro Mart in person because they often get way better prices and deals in person than I can online because I can negotiate with them. So again, you might see some vendors on all three websites. You might see a vendor only on one website, but they could all have different prices. So definitely make sure to do your research before you put in your buys. And here's another bonus tip about buying in person. If you can attend a trade show like Magic in Las Vegas, essentially every vendor and brand under the sun has a booth at these trade shows and you'll most definitely find the perfect vendors for your boutique there. It is by far my favorite event to attend. All right, so those are the three main websites that people shop at to buy wholesale. Comment below and let me know which of these online showrooms you're going to check out. And also, if you found this video helpful, I would love it if you could give it a like and subscribe to my channel. And as always, thank you for watching and I'll see you next week. Bye.